12 months ago, we watched our stages crumble in front of us. For those of us in Adelaide at convention last year, we heard dings and rings as people fielded cancellation after cancellation. As a community, we've had to emerge from the rubble and learn how to stand on top of the ruins of what we once knew. 2020 was about doing what we had to do to survive. We pivoted, we learned how to be our own AV techs, and we got really good at digital engagement. 2021 will be about doing what we want to do. What do we want to take forward from the past? What do we want to leave behind? Who do we want to work with? Who do we want to become? By the time we converge in 2022, it will be time for us to crystallize our new narrative. We must reclaim, redefine, and reignite the platforms from which we create transformational change for our audiences around the world. And this journey will be full of paradoxes. We must be fiercely Australian. And be fiercely global. We must honor the past and embrace the future. We must do well and do good. To do this, we must look for our next stage. And to do that, we must take our craft, our business, and ourselves to the next stage. Join us in March 2022 for a convention that will epitomize everything we need to thrive in this new era of speaking. We will be exploring four elements that are critical to our next stage. The first is mindset. The second is business. The third is production. And the fourth, craft. And where better to hold this event than the Sofitel Broad Beach in the Gold Coast? It's early days yet, but we've already booked some fantastic speakers from around the world. Let's take a look at them now. Energy poverty quite simply condemns billions. Toxic smoke in houses kill more women and children than AIDS and malaria combined. Joining us for more on this program is Simon Doble, who's the CEO and founder of Solar Buddy. Simon, thanks for being here. I had the absolute pleasure of standing on stage with this man. I was completely blown away by what he does. And I ridiculously tried to mimic what it was like to live in a refugee camp by living in this tent for three months. Turn on your light. Let's light up this room. Today, I'm sitting down with Angelique Ruers. She's been called the undisputed champion. Undisputed champion. The undisputed champion at helping small businesses land big clients. Everybody, Keith Abraham here. Really looking forward to being part of the PSA convention in 2022. I'm going to share with you four foundations that'll help us move out of the quagmire of challenges into the ocean of opportunities, and more importantly, create businesses that are sustainable, profitable, and are predictable, so that you can have great recurring revenue, you can have scalable speaking fees, and more importantly, leverage your IP. Look forward to seeing you on the Gold Coast. Bye now. Our intention during Convention 2022 is to make you feel excited and confident about your next stage. Steve Lowell, please give him a hand. I'm gonna reach inside your wisdom, your knowledge, your experience. Thank you. I got time. Go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> and I knew I was really good at it. I knew I was different at it. Going to something a little more difficult. We're gonna challenge you. But they didn't know I was different. And this is the result. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you found this of value. My name is Steve Lowell. Thank you so very much. You may see some of the same speakers you've seen before, but we guarantee you will not see them present the same messages or material. They're going to go behind the scenes to deconstruct how they do what they do so well. 
And the one thing that I'm personally thrilled about is the fact that there won't be any panels. No panels? What do you mean no panels? We can't have a convention without panels. Oh my God, Jack, you know how I feel about panels. They're so lame. Hey, PSA, my special request. At next year's convention, I'm going to be showing you how to create extreme panels. Yes, Kim, panels. Now, I was gonna start this video promo by confidently saying the majority of panels are lame. Now, I didn't because I would be underselling the reality, almost all panels are lame. Now you know this because you have all experienced them. Many of you have organized them and most of you have suffered from being on them. So then why do panels exist at all? Two reasons. First, they're the inevitable go-to format for meeting planners when they don't know what they want. Hey, let's do a panel. Yeah, of course. Second is optimism. Every once in a while, a panel actually is amazing, and that is what's remembered. The rare is unicorn panel that did rock versus the legion of panels that induced mental naps. Now, this matters because every speaker will be asked at some point to moderate a panel. If you have, you know the pain. If you haven't yet, oh, it's coming. I'm Brian Walter, and I'll see you at the 2022 PSA convention. See, Kim, the panels will be fine. And so are you and I as co-conveners with the help of everyone across PSA. You see, we don't know who we don't know. So keep an eye on your inbox in April as we send out a global call out for speakers and breakout facilitators. But before that, there will also be an email from Margaret, which will be the first of our crowdsourcing exercises. We want to know who and what you want to see and also who and what you don't want to see. No promises, but we are definitely looking for your input. You may also be waiting for the link and the urgent shout out to buy your tickets today. Well, there's no such thing this year. That's right, we're not going to take your money today and you don't have to make any hard decisions right now. But as a ticket holder to this convention, you will get exclusive early access to superb pricing in September when we officially launch PSA Convention 2022 to the unsuspecting public. From both of us, that is all for now and we'll see you in 2022.